Okay, so okay, we wanted so we to take some photographs in the style of Bing Wright, who uses a cracked mirror to get very, very beautiful photos. So here's a couple of examples of his. Now, he's doing this on a really sunny, beautiful uh, so kind of sunset skies. Our day isn't so good, as you'll see when we get to the end, but this is what we did. Started off with the mirror, took it off of its swivel stand, just by undoing the screws, and then took the back panel off of the thing to reveal the back of the glass so this is the back of the silver glass um so you can see there we left it in the frame but that's just showing you the glass so we covered all the back in parcel tape uh, lots of it so that when the glass um cracked it didn't fall out and so it all would kind of stick together um so you'd need to do something like that and then we just push the uh, wooden panels back on again uh, hold it in with its staples which we've bent up push push them back down so it looks back now as it was when we started, but now the um, glass is all kind of taped together. Covered it um, in a towel and had a go at smashing it, first of all, with a chisel and a rubber mallet. Um, didn't make any headway at that at all. Uh, ended up doing it with um, hammer blow uh, through the towel, but directly uh, with the hammer onto the glass. And got this effect. The first go um, didn't really produce enough crack, so we did a second blow. And from one of them, you can see that it, the glass crumbled more than we would have liked. So it actually looks a bit kind of open in that bit. But we did get some kind of reasonably nice effects. And we did get um, some nice cracks. So here we can see it's a very dull day. So we can't get that kind of really nice colour. Um, but it did basically work. So if you wanted to have your own go at this, that's our advice on how to make it work.